Hello everybody, this is Maximum Donut. Welcome to um, an episode of Hearthstone Shorts. Uh, basically this series, I guess, um, I don't know how many episodes it's going to involve because I don't know how often it's going to happen, but uh, I've gotten to 11 wins on an off-camera uh, arena run, so I am going to yeah record the last uh, few games if it happens that I get to you know 11 wins it 11 and 0 or 11 and 1 you know maybe it'll be a few few games today it's uh, definitely going to be just uh, one game <laughs> oh, my poor friend um, so yeah I'm just going to show like what a deck list at this number of wins actually involves and how I actually got to this stage so it has um, you know two arcane shots which is really good for early control particularly in arena where and in this current meta game where three two Stat distribution two drops are very very common, and it's got some very powerful uh, early drops as well, like knife juggler and mad bomber. Uh, the unleash the hounds combo, obviously with starving buzzard, is in the deck as well. Um, and then going into the mid game, I've got a few like pretty decent cards with um, animal companion emperor cobra harvest golem, um, iron for grizzly. Their beasts they combo out with um, with the starving buzzard as well. I actually took uh, two Hound Master quite early in the hopes of getting a beast centric um, hunter deck, which luckily for me it worked out that way. I've also got a few very powerful um, mid game cards such as Ancient Brewmaster, Chewing Yeti, and Defender of Argus is obviously a very solid card. I, choose a, I chose um, Oasis Snapjaw as a bit of a less ideal uh, beast, but still it's you know, worked out okay if I can get the um, Hound Master to buff it up, then it becomes a 4-9 Taunt, which is actually quite, quite difficult to deal with. Uh, the Stampeding, two Stampeding Kodos and two Frost and Elementals are actually really, really good, sort of, um, you know, sort of the early late game or the late mid game, I guess, uh, those terms are a little bit confusing, but they give you a, a, an element of control and allow you to take um, control back from your opponent. So this Hunter deck has worked out quite well. There's also a bit of synergy with Imp Master and Knife Juggler as well. And um, the Spiteful Smith, for those of you who are confused, um, the reason why that's in there, um, despite me not having any weapons, is because 5 mana for a 4-6 stat distribution wise is pretty decent. So, Alright, let's um, you know, win or lose. The deck's gone 11 wins, which is you know quite nice. I, uh, I just got back from Singapore just now, um, like literally stepped off the plane maybe two, three hours ago. And I've got this really bad stomach ache, so if for some reason I have to leave, it's probably because I'm having horrible bouts of diarrhea. And no, I'm just joking. I, I hopefully will be fine. No promises though. Mm -hmm. Wow. I, um... A mirror match at 12 wins. At 11 wins. I can only hope that his draw is terrible. So I'm hoping to. Hmm. So depending on what he drops, uh, turn one. Yep. It looks like I'll be coining out Imp Master turn two. Uh, the the Lepinome and all other one drops are actually really good for me to see. Um, wow! So it's like a rushdown hunter deck, which yeah, I could just clear both those cards right now if I wanted to. But I think it is worthwhile me getting some board presents. It only leaves me with a 1-1 um, a one -one if he chooses to spend both of those minions on it, but, you know, it has still cleared his board for me, so I'm okay with that. He's just going straight for Rushdown. Okay. So now I am a little bit concerned, but he's given me board control. This board is slightly resistant to um, multi-shot, so that's something as well. Although having lots of minions 
against a hunter is not necessarily a good thing because of Unleash the fucking hounds. What have I done? <laughs> wow, just... This is madness! Hmm. Alright, so... Wow, wow, we are. I don't uh, want to have so many minions on the board, <laughs> but oh well. What can I do? <laughs> this is probably going to be a pretty fast episode. I feel like six more damage is coming straight at my face quite soon. Uh, hmm. But otherwise, I've got a fair amount of damage on board. Oh my god. <laughs> What have I done? What have I done? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> this is not good news. Gotta clear these off. Mm hmm. <laughs> Kind of want a something with taunt. Okay, I'm in a pretty nasty spot right now since I'm effectively on three. Since I'm pretty sure that's an explosive trap. Three, one. Oh, I'm like pretty much screwed. I think I've been rushed down so fast. Anyway, let's find out. I guess I win or lose right here. If he has a way of dealing me one more damage, then I lose. Fuck! <laughs> I'm ready to learn. Oh god. <laughs> um. Well. Actually, so five, so it'll be nine, ten, eleven. So I can win with this if it actually registers. If it just kills me, then I die. Yeah, I die. Damn! <laughs> oh, wow. I think my mistake was being a bit too greedy. I should have used my... Um, my Unleash the Hounds as a board clearing card rather than a... Uh, rather than just go, go getting like really greedy because obviously having lots of minions makes his Unleash the Hounds much more valuable than my Unleash the Hounds. Yeah, so that was uh, unfortunately my mistake. I haven't actually been in a situation where that has happened to me, so... Yeah, well, anyway, my rewards... A gold savagery. I think I already had two gold savageries. But anyway. Um oh, I guess we'll open our pack as well. Damn. A little bit sad about that loss. Alright. So um yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this um rather short video. Um and hope I don't know my deck construction gives you some idea of what kind of things that 
can make you successful in a arena run with the hunter in particular i mean you know i didn't have any of the really strong late game cards like uh the six five scar was it the um savannah high main and still the deck wound up doing fairly decently although i was lucky in that i had some beast synergy in my deck all right anyway thanks for watching guys i will see you in the next episode